I'm Ellen. Today I'll be teaching twice as fancy. Keep in mind that this video is mirrored and feel free to change up the speed of this video using the YouTube settings based on your own preference. You can also replay and repeat any of the parts that I'm teaching using the timestamps given in the description box or in the pinned comment. Don't forget to stretch before you begin dancing and make sure to follow us on Instagram and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more content. Let's start. So the course starts on count one. We're going to have our left arm out like that. So just have three fingers out and point forward. And then our right hand is going to grab our left wrist. So this is one. And then two, just going to bend your knees and have your head go to the left side. Also have your hip go a little bit to the left side. So this is one, two. And then three, you're just going to come back. And then on three, and you're going to bring up your right hand like that and cover up half of your face. At the same time, take a little step with your left foot, just in place. And then on four, your hand is gonna flip to the other side. So now your palm is facing outwards. And make sure you have a bigger gap in between your index finger and your middle finger, so then your eyes can be seen. So this is three and four. At the same time, your right leg is gonna go out like that. Make sure it's straight. So this is on four, and then we're just gonna slowly come up and bring in that right leg. On six, we're gonna have our hands go out and then flip to the back. So this is on five and six. At the same time, our right leg is going to take a step back and you're also going to kick up the left foot. So this is three, four, five, and six. And then you're going to land your left foot on six and and then take a step out on seven. So it goes five and six and seven. At the same time, our hands are going to go in circular motions and you're just going to go clockwise. At the same time, bend your knees a little bit and do a little body weight. So this is six and seven, eight. So your hands are just going around and you're also moving your chest a little bit as you do this. And we go seven, eight, and then one. So basically it goes from low, middle, to high. As you do the one, we also kick up our left foot and make sure it's straight. So we go seven, eight, one. And then up two, our hands are going to flip to the other side. So it's just going to go one, two. At the same time, you're just going to land that left foot. So it is seven, eight, one, two. And then we're going to drop our arms and just bring the foot. Here's when every member points towards a different direction. So I learned from Nayan, and she's just going to go two, and three. So she points forward with her left foot out and her left finger pointing forward. But depending on which one you're gonna learn from, you can choose what to do. Okay, so we go seven, eight, one, two, and three, four. And then a five, six, we move to the next formation. So we're just gonna step left, right. So that's on count to five, six. And then on seven, eight, we're going to have both of our hands up like this, and it goes seven and eight. So your right shoulder should go up first on seven, and then your right shoulder goes down, and then it goes up like that. And at the same time, your body is changing its orientation, so it's first facing towards the left side, and then towards the right side. So this is on seven and eight. Okay, let's review everything that we learned so far from the top. From here, ready? Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, six, and seven, eight, one, two, and three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Moving forward after we're here on eight, we're going to jump out and have our left knee a little bit bent, and then your hands are like this. So they're crossing at the wrist and your right hand is on top of the left hand. And make sure your hands are like this. So they both have one finger out. So this is on one. And then on two, bring both of your feet together and face forward and have your hands out like this. And then on three, and we're gonna flick inwards, outwards. So this is two, three, and. On two, have our knees bent a little bit like that. And then as you flick, we're gonna go up, down. So this is two, three, and. And then on four, we're going to straighten our legs again, have our left hand come here, and point forward with our right hand. So this is one, two, three, and 
four, on five, we're not gonna do anything, and then on five, and just bring your hands in like this to prep for the next move. And then we're going to open and open and open. So you're gonna open three times, and it's on the count, six and seven and eight. At the same time, our knees will open, and our body will lean left, right, left, so it looks like this. Five and six and seven and eight. Make sure you bend your knees more so your body will drop level. Okay, so moving on, after you go six and seven and eight, we're gonna have both of our hands come together and you're gonna bring it down and also have your body face towards the right side and this is on counts one, two. At the same time, we're gonna step right, left. So it goes one, two. And then on three, bring both of our feet together and have our hands touch here. And then on four, we're gonna step with our left foot and point forward with our right hand. So this is on four. And then we will continue walking and walk five, six, seven. So this is when they move into the next formation. After we go five, six, seven, on eight, we're gonna to jump together and have our body face a little bit towards the left side and have our right hand go around like this. Also have your head tilted this way. So this is on eight. Okay, let's review the past two eight count that we just did, starting from here. So we go seven and eight, one, two, three and four, five and six and seven and eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. After we do this on eight, we're going to step out with our left foot, and then we're going to go left, right, left, right. So you're just taking small steps in place and go left, right, left, right on the count of one, two, three, four. At the same time, make sure your hip is going forward, back, forward, back. And at the same time, we're gonna have our right hand out like this. So you're gonna have your thumb, index finger, and pinky out. This is also the sign language for I love you. One, two, three, four. On four, you're gonna shoot out this right arm, make sure it's completely straight, and it's gonna go around here. At the same time, your hip, after we go one, two, three, four, while our arm goes around like that, our hip is gonna go around also clockwise towards the left side. So they go around like this. And then our hip is gonna go forward one more time. So it counts, this goes five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, on six, our hip is a little bit forward and you're gonna take a little step back just to prep for the next move. And our hand is still out here. And on seven, you're just gonna jump together. So mainly bring your right foot back here to meet your left foot. And at the same time, on seven, we're gonna have both of our hands come in and flick outwards. And on the eight, we're gonna flick one more time but flick inwards. So this is seven, eight. And at the same time, we're just gonna bounce with it. So we go seven, eight. So let's review this point move again. Starting from here, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. For the next move, there are two versions, depending on which row you want to learn from. For the first row, we're gonna to slide towards the right side, have our right hand here and left arm out like that, pointing towards the left side, and also look towards the left. And then for the second row, which is the version that I'm going to do, we're gonna to slide towards the left side, have our left hand here and have our right hand up, pointing towards the left side. So this is on one. And we're just going to stay there for the next four counts. So we go one, two, three, four. And then we're going to have our left foot come in and in. At the same time, have our hands go left, left. So just flicking towards the left side. And then we're going to do the same thing, but turn to the right side and then flip the move. So this goes seven and eight. It's all together, it looks like this. Five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, and then moving on, we're gonna do this point move again. So after we do seven and eight, we're gonna step out with our left foot and have our right hand here, right in front of our forehead, and it goes one, two, three. And this time it's different because we're gonna start walking towards our next formation, but still have this hand shoot out on four. And as we shoot this out, we're gonna start walking with our right foot. So this goes four, five, six, seven. So our hand is still gonna go across like that, but we're just gonna to continue to walk towards wherever we want to walk to. And then 
on seven, we have both of our feet together and our hands are gonna go seven, so they still come in and flip outwards. And on eight, we're gonna bring it down like that and also bend your knees. So it goes seven, eight. So after we're here on eight, we're gonna face forward and bring up our left knee and also touch it with our right hand and then go back and then touch our right knee and then go back. So this is on one and two and. And then moving on, our hands are going to cross like that. So right hand over left hand. And then they're going to open. This is on three and. On four, bring both of our hands here in front of our chest. This is on four. And then on four and, we're going to lean forward and open. So it goes three and, four and. And that's the end of the chorus. We'll review everything slowly from the top with count and then with 75% speed music, and then full speed music. Starting from this move, ready? Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, and four, five, six, and seven, eight, one, two, and three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, and four, five, and six, and seven, and eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two and three and four and. At the end of each chorus, when they sing fancy whoop, they also put their hands together and do fancy. So have your right hand up like that and then switch. So it goes fancy and then whoop is a poke. Instagram. See you next time.